I freaking love this machine. Oh, man. Makes good espresso. I've had the Breville Bambino for, it's been about a year now. Yeah, about a year. And I thought I'd come at you guys with a quick little video talking about this machine and how it's held up over one year. That is like the perfect amount of time to figure out is something good, is something bad. Um, so I'm going to give you guys the one year review on this Breville Bambino. I just love that name, Breville Bambino, because it's a beast. And this machine just pumps out espresso like it's no problem. In the last year, nothing has broken with this machine. All the parts are still working. Pumps out espresso like it's no big deal. The milk frother is great. Yeah, it's clogged a few times, but that's been my own fault, you know. Sometimes I don't purge the wand after I'm done. Uh, so yeah, everything has been fantastic. Nothing has broken. Uh, I have bought obviously some accessories to go with this machine so uh, just to make the process of making coffee a whole lot better and it has helped yeah you have to spend extra money but it is worth it my friend and honestly honestly the star of this show is my coffee grinder if you buy this machine and you have a not so good coffee grinder or you got one of those cheap $20 ones from Target you are gonna say that this machine sucks, but in reality, it's your coffee grinder. So get yourself a coffee grinder, man. You really need a cafe style coffee grinder. No, I have the Barazza Virtuoso Plus. It's like a $270 machine. The, the little brother of that machine is the, uh, the Encore, I think it's called. And that one's like a hundred bucks less, but does about the same thing. That machine, honestly, honestly is enough for this machine so get yourself a coffee grinder get a couple accessories i'll show you those right now you need a tamper uh you need well it comes with a tamper but it's garbage you need a uh, distributor you don't but i like it because it just really helps get everything even and you need a knock box to save your life uh, to save your uh, uh, relationship so that you have a place where your <laughs> coffee grinds can go <laughs> That was a joke, by the way. Might I also recommend one of these? This is, this, this is what's gonna make you good coffee every single day. You might actually already have one of these. I don't know. But anyways, <laughs> there, you know, the only thing that I do not like with this machine is one thing. Let me show you guys. This is my number one gripe with this machine. You turn it on. Now, when you, uh, after you've pulled your shot and you're about to steam your milk, here is something that you need to do before you steam your milk because it is going to add extra water to your milk, which honestly, are you gonna notice maybe is it a big deal? Not so much, but do you need the extra water? You don't. So here, I'm gonna show you guys right now. So we're gonna steam our milk, we're gonna press the button, and while your wand is in your milk, and you probably won't even notice this, you'll see that. Look how much water just came out of the wand before it even started steaming your milk. Well, to me, that's a pretty substantial amount of water, and I definitely don't want that in my milk. I mean, it's, it's a lot of water. I don't know how else to uh, to quantify it, but yeah, it's <laughs> it's it's a lot. That's really the only thing that I uh, I don't really like about the machine. So what do I do before I make uh, some froth milk? Just oh, what are one? I just hit it first. Get the water out. Then I take the one, take the milk, put it in. So yeah, it's a little extra work, but hey, it works and. Uh, if that's the only downside to this machine, uh, then I'll take it. I'll take it every day. And with those accessories, my friends, you'll be making espresso, lattes, macchiatos, iced coffee drinks, anything you want for days. Smash that like button, hit subscribe. You know I really appreciate it, and uh, you know I like when, I, when you come and watch my videos. 
So uh, let me know you're there. Say something in the comments, man. You guys are quiet. You guys are so quiet. Let's go. Let's get that energy. Let's get that energy. I know maybe it's the lo-fi beats that's getting you guys uh, all relaxed. You can't even type something on the keyboard, but hey, whatever. Uh, I know you guys are still showing the love. So have a great day and I'll uh, we'll see you guys in the next video.